Hello everyone on an ideal day for football coming to you from a venue that used to be called the old Peacock Ground but of course we know it as Elland Road. I'm your match commentator Derek Ray at the microphone and sitting alongside me is the former Arsenal, West Ham and Coventry midfield player Stuart Robson and the general feeling is we should be in for a spellbinding occasion. It's Wolfsberger Arce and they take on Milan well, Derek, when looking forward to this game, you can't help but notice there are some great matchups all over the pitch, particularly in those central areas. Whichever team wins more of those battles will win the game. Here's the Milan team. Mike Mignon begins in goal. Teo Hernandez starts with Davide Calabria in the fullback positions. And leading the line today, Olivier Giroud. Well, every team needs an effective and proficient leader of the line and Olivier Giroud falls in that category. Stuart, what should we look forward to seeing from him today? Well, Derek, he's a great all-round player, but it's his ability to run in behind... Oh, opportunity defense. here, Stuart! There it is! A delightful start to this match. Just what they were hoping for. Well, let's look at the replay. They move the ball so well, just waiting for an opening. But there's still plenty to do from here. He hits it so well, though. Lots of pace, lots of power, and the keeper just can't react in time. It's a great strike. So the game has been restarted. It's Milan in front here. Torsten Röcher and a creative look about this could be troublesome Linde could be dangerous as clean as a whistle that challenge Rebic Theo Hernandez now Oh, lovely weighted ball. They might be in. Not going to get away with that because it's offside here. And he shouldn't be offside there. He's gone too early. And that's a waste of a great opportunity. And a yellow card it's going to be, Stuart. Yeah, the ref's got that right. It's a yellow card all day long. Brahim. And a long way out here. Oh, that's textbook goalkeeping. Delivering it. Fantastic effort. He made great contact, but the keeper more than equal to it. Favouring the short one. And Giroud waits to fire. It's in. They're looking really relaxed and confident. And not giving the opposition much of a look in. Let's take another look because it's a well-worked short corner that just changes the angle of the cross and it ends up with a fairly simple finish. Certainly not much the goalkeeper can do about that. A second goal for them here.
Thorsten Röcher. And do they mean business on this occasion? Giroud. And still danger here. And they can't quite take advantage in the end. This has been a top-class display today. Just look how many chances they've created. And if they want to, they could score a hatful of goals here. Diaz. This looks promising. Diaz. Well, diving magnificently to make sure he got there. It's a short one. Effective challenge. Counter attacking very much an option. Giving the ball away. Good vision. Can he get onto this? Into the advanced position. Oh, good reflexes from the keeper, and the danger averted. And the short option preferred. Rebic. Echelon goalkeeping there. Who can they pick out? Well, the clearance, half-hearted. Can he make it count? And he gobbles up the second chance. Disappointment for the keeper. No wonder he's asking questions of his defence. Well, here it is again. And I feel a bit sorry for the goalkeeper because he makes a very good save to start with. Where are his defenders following in? It's the attackers that get there first, and it's a very good finish. On with the game then, and it does appear that Milan are out of sight. The referee correctly decided to play advantage. Torsten Röcher. The first half here comes to an end. As anticipated, plenty of talking points so far. And now the second half is underway. Well, possibilities in the centre. It comes to nothing in the end. And the referee spotted the foul, but has played advantage. Jihou. Good looking ball. There could be a chance now. In it goes! Such a complete performance. Four in front now. Well, as you can see, he doesn't mess about here, does he? He's strong, well balanced, and skillful. That's a top class finish.
A lopsided contest, 4 0. Olivier Giroud. Opportunity it is. Terrific save. Well, that's a top class save. He read it so well. So deciding to make a personnel change at this juncture. Who's going to get on the end of it? Oh, there it is! It's one goal after another, and it speaks to the quality of that performance. Well, here it is again, and you have to say, it's the perfect delivery into the danger area. And then what a great finish as well. Good connection with the ball, leaving the keeper with little chance. It's a great goal. has been one-sided but they deserve the plaudits for the fact that they've kept going and going and he read it superbly 30 minutes to go then Rebic Rebic it needs an accurate cross and you need your defender to take charge. And a fantastic diving save. Both managers deciding this is the time to change things around. Both teams going to the bench. And now the delivery. It might still be problematic. Just 20 minutes remaining now. Zlatan Ibrahimovic. It's opening up for them. Well cleared away. Ibrahimovic. Rebic. Marvellous anticipation. Clearing the lines. And so it will be a corner now. Well, they are committed to making the substitution here. And short it is. Plays it back. And blocked for now. Well, he likes to run at them. 
Alessandro Tonali. Oh, he couldn't outwit the keeper. Now they're going to alter things. Here's the substitution. Short corner favour. And making his move inside. Promising possession, this. Oh, magnificent reaction. Novak Baumgartner and given away and you don't want to lose possession there Ben Asser. now with Ibrahimovic Alexis Salamakers And the referee is going to add on four added minutes. Torsten Röcher. He has time to play it over. And deliver towards the back post. Well, it's actually ended up being easy meat for the keeper. And there it is, the final whistle. Not what the home fans were hoping for before a ball was kicked today. Defeat for them. You're absolutely right, Derek. While the result is poor, the display was even worse. They never got to grips with the opposition. They were second best in every facet of the game. They need to do a lot of improving before the next time out. Well, I don't think, Stuart, anyone can really quibble about what he put into the game. Well, that performance sums him up, really. You're never disappointed with what he gives you. Such a good player.